Hi, I'm Sean Duggan, and welcome to the Lightroom Viewfinder. As your image archive grows, you'll eventually run out of space on your current hard drive, and you'll need to move the files onto a larger capacity drive. In this episode, I'm going to show you how to move your Lightroom image library onto a new hard drive, and then relink everything to the Lightroom catalog file so you don't run into those vexing question marks that appear when Lightroom can't find the folders that it's looking for. It's actually pretty simple, so let's get started. First, if possible, it helps to have all of your images logically organized and not stored in unrelated folders all over your hard drive or unorganized across several hard drives. As your archive grows, of course, it's likely that you will have your images stored on multiple hard drives, but having these organized and being very familiar with how they're organized is important. Taking time to develop a logical file organization system is time well spent and will pay off whenever you have to migrate the image library onto new and larger capacity storage media. Once you have a new larger capacity hard drive, either move or copy the files onto that new drive. In my case, my current originals archive is on a 2 terabyte drive. If I open the folders, you can see how the files are organized. I need to move them onto a new 4 terabyte drive. To do that, I'll just drag and drop the primary image archive folder onto the new hard drive. Since the files are going to go to another hard drive, the default behavior on a Mac is for the files to be copied. If you want to move them instead, hold down the command key when you drag and drop. In this case, I just chose to copy the files so that I would temporarily have them in two places. Now, if you have a large image archive, keep in mind that it will take some time for the files to be copied or moved onto the new drive. In my case, it took many, many hours, and I set it up to copy the files overnight. Now I've already done this, and if I open up the 4 terabyte hard drive, you can see the same folder structure exists here. Now that the image library files are on the new hard drive, I'll unmount the original hard drive so that Lightroom doesn't see those images anymore. If you store your Lightroom catalog file on the same external hard drive as the images, you would have to move that over to the newer hard drive as well. Now I'll start Lightroom. And you can see the question marks on the folders, as well as the exclamation marks on the image thumbnails, that indicate that Lightroom cannot find the actual folders where the images are stored. This is because the 2 terabyte hard drive where it thinks they are is not currently connected to my computer. Fortunately, it's a very simple fix to point Lightroom to the new location of the image library. I'll simply right click on the top level folder that contains my images, and I'll choose Find Missing Folder. Then, using the window that appears, I'll navigate to the new hard drive, select the same top-level folder that's there, and click Choose. And that's it! Lightroom now associates the image catalog with the new location of the image files on the larger capacity hard drive. I'm Sean Duggan. Thanks for watching the Lightroom Viewfinder.